right. Excellent connection. Things like that. Let me just fix one last thing. And let's see if we are live. Are we live? I believe so. That is good news for me. Sorry, this is just me trying to learn how to <laughs> create a live stream and do a few things. Let me just check my Discord real fast. Yeah. Alright. <clears throat> so, it's been a while since I played Avon Colony, and I thought, you know, we will do just a live stream on top of this. Let me just change something real fast. Let me just put this through my headset, and so you guys don't get double. Uh, ooh. Ooh. I'll have to change that around. Okay, no. There we go, there we go. Hopefully this is working. Thank you. If anyone is watching or does watch this in the future, thank you. So let's get to work on this. I think for me, hmm. You know what, we'll do uh, Greetings, your excellency. No, we aren't gonna do the hollow soon. have you back again. Let's uh, let's try to do a quick one run on this. We'll do it on normal. Resupply pods one environmental, because I have not done this in a long, long time. So let's try to see. Yeah, yeah, this looks good. What you guys think? All right, we'll launch it as farmers and do the first mission. Welcome to Venar. All right, new mission. Welcome. Your colonists have been informed of your arrival and are eager to see what their leader can do for them. Give me a second. Open widget, warning, stream. Which is not optima. Alright, you know what? I'm just not even going to worry about that. Alright, so let's get here. Buildings, things like that. So, as I said, it's been a very long time since I played this. We need a new water pump. Uh, yeah, right there looks good. We'll build one. Try to learn a few of these keys. <clears throat> oh, it's kind of lonely here in the channel. No one's joined yet. But that that's okay. That's okay. All we're doing is relaxing a bit. Uh, water power has lost this. That's because we do not have enough stuff. Your colony right. could benefit from a higher level of Let's see, what do we have good round to? Let me zoom out. Melons. Uh barley's okay. That's not good. That's alright. Let's go with some melons and we will put them right here. <coughs> Excuse me. Now one reason I'm not building them next to each other is I remember this much. You uh, kind of have a little bit of an issue with that. It slows down people being able to get through because the buildings are slow. Uh, kind of just like this one. Ooh, I'm doing the uh, ooh, ah, e. Talking to my witch doctor again. <laughs> Hopefully I'll learn how to stop doing that type of stuff. So This is the starter one, as you can see. People sure are unhappy because, you know, we don't have food. The water's kind of, eh, we need more power. There we go. I'll be quiet for them. Hello, Governor. 
I wanted to remind you that the mission objectives from my team are here only to guide you. While several of these objectives are necessary in order to complete your mission, your first priority should be the safety of your colony. As an experienced colony governor, we trust your judgment, and I urge you to take your time and put your colonists ahead of your mission. Good luck. Okay, so as you can see, we, we got those colonies. Uh, they want me to build a wind turbine, so I'll try to get that. Let's get these uh, things here. And I am, whoops, wrong clicker. So I'm going to build it right there, and I don't really like using them. As you can see, we have a geothermal vent, and I need a geothermal coffee drink at the moment, so give me one second. Hmm. Mmm. Nectar of the gods. <laughs> or in this case, cheap coffee of the gods. <laughs> so one of the things that we are doing... See, I can get these cargoes, but we need to be in range, and that is not. It's just right out there, so I'll probably build one there. But for now... Need to get that up and mining processing. In fact, how much would it be to upgrade this? Uh, 12. Yeah, we're gonna do that. I think another oh, mining me. Would yep, be a good look idea. at that. <laughs> Jumping a little ahead in a bit. Another coffee sip. I'm low on coffee. Gonna have to get some more. Or I'll just have to deal with it. So let's see. Water's still an issue. Then I can see. But we can upgrade this. Once we get these built. <coughs> Excuse me. Allergies. Once we get this built. We can get some copper in. And we can use the nanite processor to make it. Now, copper's very quick, iron's very quick. The sludge there is painfully slow. It is just painful. And I do mean painful. So, once we get this upgraded... Oh, we got a reward. I'm pleased with the progress of your Food we're still positive on. I want to expand quickly, so we're going to go with the nanites. In fact, here soon I'm going to need to build stuff to get more people. So, as we can see here, we are in summertime. Winter is going to be a problem for me. Turn on. Okay, yeah. Here we go. I support doing this because that will cap off that vent and when you do not cap off these vents they will oh goodness I have lost colonies because of those vents and toxic gas speaking about gas how is our O2 now there used to be a way to actually see that uh, it's over and that's true Aha! Overlays. See, here, here, and here are lowering our air quality, so I'm going to have to take care of those here in a bit. Along with some other things. First off, let's go ahead and upgrade this again. Your colony could benefit from Living space, that is true. We will need to do that. One of the things about outposts, uh, habitats, things like that. Your colonists do not like long travel. The closer you are, the better. I don't like that water issue right now. We are, we are going to upgrade that. And we have that. That is iron deposits. Zorium. So, once we get that water up, I'm going to see. And I'm going to put that up there. I think I can hit this. Yeah. <coughs> okay. So, let's 
see. Water, 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 water. Okay, water's kind of bad there, so we will put it there. That will allow them to get into that area. Then I'm going to build that there. First off, I need to get this. Right. These are your starter modules, and I should talk about them. They're okay when starting out, and normally I don't deconstruct them unless I'm getting close to issues with space. We, have some thoughts on how yeah, we need that. Because I wish to expand. And, yep, so about right there. Here is our. Okay, here is our. <laughs> up. Oh, goodness. I was a little confused there. And I'm gonna build this right there and hope we get stuff. One thing about the geothermal, we don't have enough people is you can do water recovery. If you're hurting for water, which we kind of are, but not hurting for energy, then you want to do that, yes. I was just thinking about this and building one of those. Storage is important. You will see me later on in this game just building massive warehouse areas. And I am not a pro at even calling him whatsoever. I, I don't take that title. I don't think I deserve that title. But one of the things about this game, and I really should have started out at the start, and I will repeat myself over this again and again and again, even calling me is that diamond that never was. You know, it, it it's kind of like you finding a bunch of uh, <laughs> graphite and finding out that yeah, you're not going to get diamonds from this. <laughs> Somehow there's a piece of quartz in there that you think is good, but then it's not really all that good. Can we pick this up yet? No, because they're taking forever. I should have put this as a high. So I'll order that to pick up. That will sustain us enough on food. I'm getting a little bit worried about the people being so unhappy, but they'll just have to deal with it. And I need to start thinking about expansion. Excuse me. Oh, goodness, goodness, goodness. I don't know where. The immigrants could be useful, but... Those nanites are very, very important. Yes. Eight power, so we don't have enough power right now to handle that. And that is bad. So let's talk about power again. These are pretty good to a degree, but they only produce six. That's your wind turbines. And they're kind of cheap to do. They can also push away toxic gases from this. But they don't produce a lot of power. Only six. Look at that. During the summer, we can get eight, which is needed. It, that's very important and you get up here to the 26 this big thing we'll get to later but I'll do a quick thing about it you have to go on the map build a solar powered colony and have them beam it via laser transmission to you it's very useful in the game but right now it's not that best it, well, it's not the best for us, if I can English, good. Zorium generation is pretty good. It's high power, but it's not renewable. And so you're going to be build, burning up these when you build up your reactors. As you build up your reactors or generators, you're going to really 
lose that. Now, you can get trade routes and build them up, but that, that troublesome, cumbersome, and a lot of times you need those trade routes for other things. Let's... For now, they want an immigration system. I want power. And so I'm trying to see if there's any steam generator. Well, GeoVents left to build a steam generator. Yes. Is that within range? Yes. Are we going to build that way? No. <laughs> uh, yes. Maybe. I don't know. Oh, iron deposit. That's good. As you can see, we are producing from that. So let's just try to get a little more energy going. And we have tier 3 there. Uh, that's something else. Steam generation or geothermal generation and the Zorium. Which I don't understand what Zorium is. I'm, it's not nuclear. I don't know what it is. These require people. These do not. I don't know if that one does. And I'll have to build up residential and stuff here. So for now, I'm going to send them back to get. Ooh, I forgot all about those. Defenses, defenses. We should have built that early on. We did not. So I'm going to put some energy batteries there. I really wish you got adjunction. Adjunction. Me English good. Uh, <laughs> you don't get benefits for putting buildings next to each other. I, I wish you did, but you don't. How are we on air? Air quality still good. That will be going down here very soon. So. Potash, potash, whatever you want to call that stuff. It's useful. For greenhouses, farms, and trading. Again, it it's a non-renewable resource. So once you use it up, it is gone. And as you get in later games, it quickly goes away. Come on guys, build a little faster pretty please. It's only a tier... Alright. I'm going to put that there to just try to get them to build a little bit faster. This is... Oh, I finished it. Okay. Oh, they're working on <laughs> other stuff as well. That's good. That's something you kind of want to do is keep them. Now, as you can see, it's only 20% efficient because we don't have the people. Normally, you don't need to mess with who's who doing what or where. I really hope that's not hurting things. And I'll be doing two series of this later, a uh, non-stream series, just out there to kind of play around uh, and get back into it. Or, wait a sec, what am I saying? <laughs> the stream right now is me just playing around with the game, trying to get back into it. I will then be doing a live commentary walkthrough where I try to go through and say this is how you do this stuff this is what you do here and then I will try to do a no commentary playthrough where I really focus on how to do things for people who don't want to uh, listen to my lovely voice <laughs> no hate okay as you can see this will go to the Promethean lander. That's not good. And I need a lot of people here. So before we really get into that, we're going to build this. And I'll have to put air pumps here. Some things that kind of help is things like the parks, the mini parks, the auditoriums, auditoriums, People can walk through them, so that's good. 
These will increase entertainment because, you know, everyone likes a little beautiful walk once in a while. Something cool, relaxing. I like walking. I'd like to recommend that you... Little habitat. Already on that. Population growth target. Yes. Already on that. Now, you're going to want to remember where you put your immigration centers because you will be coming and toggling these on and off, off and on. And especially later games when you start having problems with populations. Which we are going to start having very soon, I predict. I'll have to build some uh, food. Food, 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 food. We have some thoughts on how to improve the air. Yes. All right. Intake fans. Good or bad? Bad. Now, I'm going to build one because we have the mission to build one. You always want to build an air filter because apparently the air around here is toxic. Or something. I don't know. Maybe everyone has bad allergies. So, we're going to pull this up. As you can see, buildings causing bad air problems. I'm going to build it here. And I'm going to go ahead and build another one of those. And I'm going to check to make sure we have enough power. So, this will cause some power issues. I'm going to put that high, you low. Let's try to get some more energy in. I can change this. Yeah, let's change that. We still have positive water and we will be increasing that soon enough. Okay. I don't know if I did a good enough job explaining O2. Things are going to foul up. Uh, you know, you're living next to a stinky geothermal. I think this just produces tons of sulfur dioxide. And you, you don't want to be breathing in sulfur dioxide, do you? It, it, it gets pretty stinky. And so what we are going to do with this is try to offset that by blowing good air in, bad air out. You can do this with parks. Parks help entertainment and other things. Pretty much industrial sectors or anything open to the air is pretty bad. Your colony could really benefit okay, we'll get to that trade hub later, but right now we need to take care of things. Things we need to take care of. Food. So, I'm going to come out here, because we can't just uh, subside, subside, sustain, subity, subity, swiggity, woogity, I don't know. We're going to need more food. Our stores won't work well enough. Uh, unexploited, yeah, yeah, yeah. Clean air, I'll have to build some stuff around here, try to keep the air up very well. But let's come to food. Crops. We know melons grow pretty well. Uh, broccoli, not so well. Corn, I always like corn. It's useful. This is very good. Corn, I think, needs to be processed. Barley can be, but it doesn't need to be. Melons are just, you eat them immediately. So let me check my thing there. Do we have enough power? Okay, we will have enough power. We will have stuff. And we'll do good enough. So that will give us nine, seven, nine. Some point something, seven, eight, nine point three. Okay, we're gonna build it up here. I'm gonna put that there. I should have put an auditorium in to help, but whatever. These cannot up outposts cannot be upgraded. Uh, habitats can be upgraded. So that's useful. Here's pretty much the best thing you can build. But you have to get a skyscraper. These give you hover cars so people can commute longer. Or they can go to other stations. Kind of like right here. And I will be building a few of these up here in a bit. Okay. We need more of those. Is 
there any other resource pods around that we could grab? There's one over there. That would be useful. Gold's just a trade good, so that's not as useful for us. That one would be useful. I, I dislike sodas. <laughs> You're going to find that my populace tends to not use soda, candy, or other things. <clears throat> For good reasons. How much iron? Ooh, we don't have enough copper. Okay. Efficiency's pretty bad. Excuse me for that moment. Let's talk about this. I tend to not use laser mines because you lose a lot of stuff. So these are like only if you really, really have to get it. Okay, we got more immigrants. That is good. We're going to build a mine tier 2 right there. We have stuff. I don't know. Can we build? I, I think that will get it in. So I'm going to have them build that. Come here, try to get this so I can get nanos. I cannot use the beacon. That will only be sent to me if things get real bad. Winter is coming. Yes. And I'm worried about the power. Alright, uh, we have that. Do we have... <sighs> Excuse me. Calling those, calling those inventory. Do we have a bunch? Okay, yeah. But we don't need it. We, we're still positive on food. So this will take a little bit to get, then we can hopefully get this, that will give us 100 nanites, we can expand a lot fast. And this game is pretty slow pace, it's good. I can increase the speed, but why? Like I said, I'm just here enjoying myself, getting reaccustomed to the game. And I'll be trying to play this a bit more on my own between as I start getting ready. And there is a game coming out very soon that I wish to live stream. Sadly, <laughs> all the other YouTubers will probably get to it before I can because I go to sleep when it's getting released. <clears throat> I know, I just miss all the fun stuff. It's not true. I will need to be getting police drones soon. There's no crime right now, but once we get past 50, we're gonna have crime, 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 crime. It'll be Chicago. Okay, you know what? We're gonna do that just a little bit, try to speed some stuff up. Here we go, we have insignificant power. No, we don't. That thing's just being up. Come on. Let's get that one. I keep hitting B thinking it will do it for me. That, that just won't do it. Okay. We're gonna build one there. There I am doing again. I've been playing so much North Guard that I think I can just hit that and be done. And then once that one, we're going to build one about right here. We have population increase, people filled, no unemployed. 35, we have 24 unhealthy, protesters dehydrated. Alright, we're good. Food's a bit lower than I like, but that's okay. Yes, 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 it's unplugged. How are we doing? Do we still have anything to be produced? No. 
You know what, I'm going to increase the priority there so that we can hopefully still get some stuff. Oh, I almost hit B again trying to do that. Let's take a look at this. Yeah, we can inch in the power. And it is not worried about toxic gas. Which gets into another thing. Things that are open. Construction hubs. Uh, police drone hubs. Geothermal vents. Uh, believe it or not. Melon farms. Or any type of farming. Hubs. If it's pretty much a hub. Integration center. Something like that. They are vulnerable to toxic gas. So... If you have stuff near here, you're going to want to put in a wind turbine to try to blow away that stuff. And that's where batteries come. Batteries will save your energy so that when you have a deficit, you can still do stuff. What? Okay, go away. Thank you. I don't need to know every time. <laughs> Just tell me when we start having issues, you know. Which, the big issues right now is just the production of materials. That's doing about that, so that's doing a bit more. I could upgrade this, but I just don't really want to. Which gets into it, you will get things like that. Recycling, exploding, yeah. We'll come to that later. Research tech is nice. We won't have to deal with artifacts. <clears throat> I already showed you that. Endgame is trying to build this. It will take a whole lot of stuff. Farming, again, I don't really like using farms. Greenhouses are more efficient. Like, how much... Can we even see how much this is producing? Yeah. And look at that same area. We can get a lot more melons that way. People do like variety. And not every food is equal. And once we start learning about xenocrops, you'll learn that your people don't like eating alien food. They like earth food. <coughs> so you will have to deal with that. Okay, food's leveled out because it is summer. We have stuff like that going on. I wish I had more. Let's go ahead, get a tier 2 up. And we'll increase that there. And upgrade. As you probably have seen, as you upgrade things, you unlock. So, we could only do tier 1, then we got the tier 2, tier 3. It drives me nuts in this game that that's how it's done. Especially later on, and that's one thing that made this game not so successful. Is that it's just rinse and repeat. You will be saying everything. You do it the same. You do the same. You get it in. You do this. It just changes up a bit. Difficulty goes up. It's a pain. Now, there is an achievement to rush through these. I'm not going to rush through this one. Again, I will try to do that with one of the Let's Plays walkthroughs later. Uh, do, do, do. I think storage is good. Where is our storage? Uh, storage could be better. A lot better. Really much better. But we're just going to wait. Speaking about that, it's not fully upgraded. It is. That's upgraded. That's good. Housing, we will probably need to build a better house soon. Which means I need to figure out where I want to build it. I'll probably come right around in this area. <clears throat> I don't play very efficiently with build placements. Never have, never will. 
what? Okay. So we should have plenty of power right now. We need to get a few more things. I really wish I could get more of these, but that's going to be a problem. So let's try to look at some stuff. That would blow through over half, so I don't really want to do that. It would take a lot of power. We aren't hurting for space that much yet. Soon we will be. They want to trade hub. Trade hubs. You know what? Let's go ahead. I'll put it right here. Because that'll give us the air efficiency, which I'm going to upgrade as well. Trade hubs are okay, they're nice. I don't really use, well, that's not true. I do use them because you kind of have to. So there we go, we got a trade hub in. We can come here, open the trade URI. Export this, that's permanent, that's permanent. I am going to do this one. I need your help to balance our supplies on the colony ship. Okay, and let's trade. Do we have this upgraded then? No. So I'm going to go ahead and upgrade that because it doesn't make sense. Goodbye, 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 goodbye. Your colony could benefit. Yeah, that is true. And like I said, you know, just find an out of the place way to build these. No one works in them. So. I'm gonna <laughs> kind of upset some stuff and just place two. No one really works at them, so it's not a problem. Winter has come. Oh, look, there's Jon Snow running away. Yeesh. Uh, yeah, that has that issue. We'll get that. That'll give us some more resources. Later games, they give you a lot less what I call startup missions. And, whoa. Oh, yeah, yeah. Here's satellite. Here's overview. You can see we got a lot of stuff we can explore, but we won't be able to end this game. We have some thoughts on how to best expand Three things we get. Nanites and broccoli. Okay, whatever. That will probably be something energy related and or air production, which I need to build more there. We will need to get some place hubs soon. I'll probably place one right there. And that's still good. Hello, Chief. I have a new opportunity. We don't have rice at the moment. But we will get some rice up for the trade. And the rice is just pretty good. I'm debating upgrading that. I probably won't. Any other trades here? Rice for pasta, yes. People love pasta, they love processed foods like that, so we may do that. <clears throat> Once, of course, we have enough people. Yes, I see, see, see. We'll soon have enough people. I should upgrade this. Yes, batteries turn on automatically. And as I've kind of shown, that lightning should, in a sense, hit those. There's several issues, and I'll show you more of them as we go on through this. Yeah, we're not going to build that. Rice. Do we have anywhere that is really good for rice? Uh, oh, that produces quite a lot right there. We'll go ahead. And I was going to use this for habitation, so... You know, just to show, because I'm pretty sure they're going to want to do a habitat here soon. We'll put one right there, and I'll probably put a park next to it just to help people out. Okay, since we have that, I'll go here. Just trade what we can, when we can. A little bit worried about 
about our water. Speaking about water, we can build these water treatment plants. So if you have a bunch of uh, <laughs> habitats, outposts, things like that nearby, you, you can use them. But I've never really seen them more efficient than using a water pump. Sometimes better than a atmospheric condenser, especially when you get into the more arid maps. Those atmospheric condensers, not that good. Your progress is satisfactory. Okay, I've been thank you. We will, of course, take the nanites. Why population could be useful. We more just need people. <clears throat> Why? Upgrade a farm. Fine. I don't like using farms. I told you I don't like using farms. Which is just one of those questions for me. If the air is toxic, to the point we can't have open air spaces and stuff, why are we using farms like this? I mean, can you imagine going out in a big spacesuit just to pluck a melon? I wouldn't. <laughs> Uh, storage modules, you know what? Yeah. Because we have these. How much does it cost? 10 nanites. We'll hey, go ahead Chief. and do that. I, gotta... I will need to get that research up. We'll probably place it right here. Oh, had I already built a habitat? Ugh. Civ mine does it again. So, one reason I'm removing these, oh, is that, yeah, this is just storage, is these are not, as I said, they're not efficient, they're kind of in the way. This I will keep, because it is useful. And it's kind of cool, you know, I like to keep some stuff, like as a history. Yes, 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 I see that. Ugh. I don't think we will have enough power to actually handle it. What do you mean not connected to Colin? What you call these? I know I was going to build a park there, but instead we'll do that and build a mini park. Get some mini parks. And we'll get one of those. Research is very useful. It, it helps you out, and you should try to get it up as soon as you can. So, I just want to make sure stuff is in range. It technically is, but we will be building more this way here in a bit. Okay, just thinking, and I'm not used to talking this much. It's just constant blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. But, <laughs> if anyone caught that reference, good for you. I'm horrible at it. So, yeah. We are almost done exporting the rice. Here we go. No research. No. Research. These are medicines, drugs, enhancements. Uh, not really all that useful, so we're gonna go ahead and upgrade. Like you to expand your colony's population. Reach a hundred. authorized me to give you a special mission of. Serium glow. Of course, you want me to do that. Serium glow, 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 glow. This and takes Antari and Xeno Sage. We will have to farm those materials, which I don't really want to do, but welcome to it. Morning, winter, greenhouses, uh, power failure, yes, we will have a power failure. Uh, it's lovely, so you know what? We have it, so one, two. That will produce plenty of power. Let's come up here, wind turbine, wind turbine, solar... They don't tell you if it is three. Okay. <clears throat> uh, 
I'd like to facilitate a trade arrangement. Berkeley cures cancer. I don't believe that, but whatever. I'll have to do this here soon. It's not really something I want to do because we are having to do tons of food, copper. And, and that's one of the things. On maps like this, your main export is going to be food and medicine, chem, stuff like that. So we'll have to come here, enable inedible crops. Wheat has to be processed, but it's pretty cool. Calco spores are more once you lose all the mineral deposits on the map. Xeno spice is very nice. Dari, but I think we need to do Antari. Which we can put right there. No power drone, so we will have to come back here and get a tier 3 built. I would rather have the tier 3 about right here. Do I want it right here? I get it anywhere else. I'm going to put a tier 3 because we're going to be expanding. I don't really want to expand right there, so we'll do that here. And I'll connect it temporarily to there. Tari's not really all that useful to me. Well, yeah. We'll soon be able to build what is called a manufacturing. Which, is it out here? Service related, food, drone management, ships. Here it is, chem plants and mills. Which I'm gonna have to build more power. Ah, you just saw right there, lightning strikes this. If we had any room in the batteries, it would charge the batteries. We don't have any room in the batteries right now. Hey, can we get that now? So that is a problem. Excuse me. And I don't think we are having any of that. Of course, it gives you soda. Soda, candy, certain things will lower your substance health, and that's just the not good. Okay. <clears throat> policies out of policy that can use power from batteries to increase them for short time. Drone boost. Scrubbers. Quarry beans. Food. Disgusting stuff. Uh, tell you what, just in case we need those. So that is the Antari, which is fine. We need to come here, build the Xenosage, which doesn't seem to like this map. I, I think the Xenosage tends to prefer dry maps. Dry. So let's just try to find a place that is not too, too bad, not too good. We'll go ahead and do that. And while we're there, so I can start getting that stuff mined out. How are we doing on production? We are doing pretty well. Let's go ahead and put this as a high priority job. This one can go back to normal priority. And let's just try to burn through that stuff. Because the more nanites we have, the faster we can grow. Yes, yes, I see this bouncing about. I don't kill. Okay. How uh, far can we build this? Okay, we could get this, but we have to build pretty far, and people won't care. Chemical plants will upgrade. Conversion, we will tell you to go ahead and make the glow. We have a new request for you. Yes, 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 we got that. 
let's check our O2. Come on. O2, make sure that the air quality is above 90. I don't like the fact that we have air. Ooh, yeah, I don't like that one bit. So we're going to go ahead and build one right there. And build one right there. And we will need a bunch more power. I really don't want to spend the last bit to get this, but you know what? We just, we need energy. We are energy hungry. So I'll go ahead and build those up. And we got a little supplies from the base, the mothership, the main station, wherever we are. Okay. We have a new trade mission available. Maybe uh, we'll do that in a bit. Once we're done with the broccoli, which, do we even have broccoli growing? I do. Doing it again. Broccoli, broccoli, broccoli. I actually love broccoli in real life. You know, just crisp. Crisp, crisp broccoli. Little bit of ranch. Mmm. Okay, I don't want to build it there. Right there is kind of fits and it's good. As I said, let's uh, come here. We won't need to use this yet, but there are things called plague spores. They are kind of a pain. Retail centers are kind of nice. Uh, some goods, medicine, drugs, things like that. Food, it's pretty good. Oh, no, enhanceries. Yeah, because you're just enhancing. That will sell the glow once we produce enough of it. Speaking about enough of it. How much do we have? Okay. You know what? I'm gonna. Okay. You know what? We can't really, because we need to do that first. Where is that broccoli? Let's burn up the potash because we're not using it. And we can burn that down later. I'm gonna put a higher priority on you. Immigration center I kinda wanna keep because we need the people. I'll have to upgrade this here in a bit. That's something else I noticed. People do not like being in crowded buildings, so you want to keep it where you're not 100% filled. Okay? People don't like it. They don't like living in a crowded apartment like me. I don't like living in a crowded apartment. I almost feel like I need to throw in some type of link or something right now to be like, please donate to me to keep Still Wolf 19 from Brocan Studios out of a crowded apartment in a nice tiny little house somewhere with good internet but away from the cities. Or in the city, I don't know, I don't care at this point, I just want somewhere nice. Uh, on that note, I don't have any links or anything, and I don't think I can <laughs> accept money through YT yet, so just, just hang with me, guys. If you're watching this years later after I posted, just hang on with me. <laughs> oh, I really want to catch that cargo pod, but I can't get it. I can't get it. Which one is this one working on? I did put it on the broccoli, right? Yes, okay, good, great. Irrigation's good, food is good. Sometimes if you're low on food, your people get upset. Even if you have enough food to last them the winter, if there's not X amount per people, like right there, 25 per people, they will be upset. Because no one likes the idea of facing starvation, even if you still have food. It's like going to a grocery store after a raid. Yeah, you have food, but for how long? You know, I, I got weirded out during the COVID lockdowns when I went to 
just go get like a box of pasta and it's like there was only four boxes on the entire shelf. It's like really? I, oh, I wanted some pasta. Energy is still holding up. That's good, but we never have enough. All right, <clears throat> people are 83. What is making them unhappy? Housing capacity, starvation, things. They're probably just bored. Yeah. So a lot of this just becomes, as you've seen, so we need some consumer goods. I'm gonna need to build a mill. Put one there. How much is this? That would take eight power, so... I tend to want to build these a bit further away than what I'm going to do, but I'm going to try to link up this area. And I'll have to get more power up with... Okay, so we will need to get another drone hub. Oh, this is all blocked. Oh, okay. This is a hillside, so we can't build up there. Okay, so that uh, changes it. We will build this about right to here. And I'm going to try to build up this way. One thing is, let's try to go ahead here, residential, health, services. We're going to go ahead and build these. Now, as you can see, things have range. So I'm going to build one there. I'm going to build one right here. And then I'm going to try to build one about right here. And as always, we're gonna build more power. Yeah, isn't this kind of weird? We're gonna go, we're gonna send you down to get that. Okay. A new trench increase health, slightly increases happiness, so we do want to get amaranthium, the glow. Social compliance reduces things. That 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 weirds me out. It's soma. It's brave new world. It's soma. I'm gonna enslave them on drugs. Was Soma from Brave New World or was it something else? I remember like in mythology that Soma was pretty much a honey drink uh, of Indian origins. Which I love mead. Love it. I don't like dry meads. The ones that are like have no honey taste. No. I, I love honey. Give me a honey mead. Oof. Okay, they're okay there. <sighs> Let's just get that upgraded, get this stuff going. Conversion. This is still taking a while, okay. How many people are here? Okay, that's why it's taking a while. We'll go ahead and upgrade this to level 3. And I'll try to get a skyscraper over here and build up it this way. Let's take a look. Three things oxygen, air quality. Not bad. Not bad. That's pretty good. I wish you got a bonus for like high air quality but you don't it, it they just penalize you the moment you fall below i will need to get one up here later I'd like what? To facilitate a trade arrangement. no but 
bread, font only. Okay, let's get some bread. And we'll get some barley. Barley, which I love barley as a eating grain and infirmary beer. <laughs> you know, be responsible. So, what does this say? We'll need Kelko and Cory. Speaking about that. Yeah, we can burn that into some wheat, which we can then make into pasta. Porridge is pretty good. I cannot remember for the life of me what the food types are. Why did I just see this? Okay, so we are getting pinged for water. So let's... Ooh. Can't get there, but that would be nice. We'll get one right there. Wonder where can I even look at the colony control overlays? Colony control. Broccoli. Food consumption is kind of a. 70, 14, they're not telling me exactly what is a good food setting, so I'll have to go to the wiki later and print that out. That way I can just look at it. <laughs> okay, come on guys, let's uh... Let's try to get some more water here. Energy is still good, even with winter. Nanite processor is okay. We getting plenty of that, yes. So, Darren should be able to kind of hold up with that. No resources, because we don't have that type of stuff. Trade hub is not doing well, but that's okay. Let's come here. We're going to get this. We're going to get another wheat. I said wheat. Sometimes you gotta get forceful with the game. Even though it's mostly me just getting forceful with my own self for misclicking something. Uh, I have a request for you for when a referendum! Okay, so we are a democracy. And that's good and bad. I use okay, so I can still use it. Since we have this, okay, let's go right there, build that back up, and I'm gonna go ahead and build a tier three or right there. We'll take the nanites, and we are almost to the point. Power's still good. That's all still good. I have some thoughts on ways. Build a bar and grill. Fine. I don't really want you. Build you right there. <clears throat> Do we even have this stuff? I have to get some more of that. Plague vaccines are nice. Probably should get some of that, but that's really gonna tear we through water. Thoughts. Okay. That spell right there. I'm just gonna save up a bit. Power is a. <laughs> See what I mean about power? Uh, since we can't really build that away anymore. And we'll be building one of these generators up here soon once we have a good stash of that. 
See. As you recall, the Constitution guarantees your citizens the right to vote. On yes, the yes, government. yes. They can vote. Let them again. vote. Do we even have barley? No. So let's just go ahead so we can get that off and uh, sure. Because I want to pretty it up a little bit. Let's build a tree park right there that will allow better commush. Commush. I love inventing new words. I do it all the time. I don't speak gibberish. Oh, time for me to shut Governor, up. Governor, during our initial exploration of Vanar, our scouts encountered an unusual alien life form. This organism is only marginally intelligent, but it does pose a great danger to our colony as it can attach to our buildings and grow very quickly. We call it the creep. Our research team analyzed the threat and quickly devised a special drone that can cleanse the creep from infected structures. I'm now uploading the schematics for those scrubber drone stations directly to your colony governance system. I recommend building one as soon as possible. Our scanners have detected several creep spores heading toward the nearby lake, and an infestation is highly likely in the near future. Alright, creeps. As you can see, I'm already kind of saying, forget you. Building this I up, I will have to build a scrubber drone anyways, because mission... So we will go ahead and build it about right here. We'll put that there. And I still want to build a skyscraper right about Good news. Here. Your citizens seem happy with your performance, and I think you have a good chance to win this referendum. Thank you. So we'll build a skyscraper here that will eat up a lot of stuff. I saw now that they are saying crime. I knew that would be happening here. Soon enough, so where are we getting crime? Minimal, minimal, minimal. Okay, we will. Yo, this thing you quickly burn through stuff. You know what, why this burns through, I'll be right back, just five seconds. Okay, back. Yes, 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 because we don't have the grid. <clears throat> do, 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 and we will soon have power. Can we even see people walking in? Oh, there we go. Who are you? Hi, Governor. I just wanted you to know I'm really enjoying this colony. I'm so happy she's enjoying it. Okay, let's go to. So we only have one. These guys are annoying. Annoying, annoying, annoying. So as you can see, this I is gonna open fire. It takes about two. But here's the feedback I've compiled from your citizens. I have some thoughts on ways you can provide retail. So they want to go ahead with this retail center. We'll build it about right here. Power, power still problem. So I'm gonna build that there, and then I'm gonna build yet another tier three here to help with the mine, the scrubber, and anything else. Support barley is gonna be a bit of a problem. No, where is our trade depot? Right here. Let's uh, open that. I really hate doing this, but we're gonna need that. I think a few more service structures would go a long way. 
Hospitals are good. I like hospitals. And we're going to build one right here. And we'll probably need to build one down there. As you can see, we're making nano medicines. And we'll go ahead and add plagues on. Temporary shutdown, no. Have you guys done much of anything? Okay. Oh, uh, enhancer, because we're kind of low production. I don't like using that. Good news. Your citizens seem happy with your performance, and I think you Thank have a you. good chance to win this referendum. Star Glow. I don't like doing that. Xeno. Let's get Xeno. Oh, wow. This is pretty amazing. Bori, are you on? Jack, where are you? Studying the flora just outside the Vanar colony. I found a strain of plant that closely mimics. So while we're all slaving away on the colony ship, you've been off picking flowers? Uh, if by that you mean has the expedition's only qualified botanist been doing his job, then yes. Yes, he has. Here, Euros. Let me send you a picture of this flower. Yes. I cannot wait to see this plant. It sounds amazing. <coughs> oh, man. You are gonna love this picture of my flower, Euros. It's got these two big, fat, pink petals on it. Jack, you just sorted a picture of your butt to the entire colony ship. I... wait, what? Jack, how many times do I have to remind you about the proper protocols for internal communications? What? No way, you gotta be... No! I meant to send that just to Euros. <laughs> Instant karma. That's it. I'm suspending your use of Twirtle until further notice. It was a completely innocent mistake, really. I meant to scan the flower, and I must have pointed the scanner the wrong way. I'm also recommending immediate disciplinary action. Sorry about all this, Governor. Hang on. I'm taking the call offline while I delete that twerk. Twerk, your Twitter, Facebook, Gab, yeah, whatever you want. What a twerp. Okay, so we have this build the generator, which we do need. How close are we to getting this? We uh, That's gonna take a while. Uh, it's gonna take a long, long while. Okay, so that's useful for me to know there. We're going to a uh, huh. Guess we can build that there. And I'm gonna put one right there. <clears throat> That's gonna cause energy problems, but we have here to worry about. This can go on there. Okay, or you can just ignore it and keep building, Drone. I mean, you good on you. Good on you. You seem very intense on finishing that police strength hub. You, you want some cousins. Got it, got it. And I need some water or coffee or something, victory, I did not boss. think. <laughs> okay, so that unlocks social policies. Policies. Come here, can do policies. Rationing, auto repair, job switching, immigration ban. A lot of these make people unhappy. Alright Jack, I deleted that twerk. You can explain yourself to Commissioner Veronica later. In the meantime, perhaps you'd like to introduce yourself to the new colony governor of Vanar. Are you serious? The governor is in on this call? Yes, Jack. And you're lucky the governor didn't get that twerk. Oh, man. You're a living legend from old Earth. Um, what did you say your name was again? I don't think you'll get much information. The governor is the silent type. They say you were the mayor of New York City and helped rebuild it after the war. I am honored to be working with you. The governor is not your boss, Jack. You don't need to brown nose. I'm not brown nosing, I'm schmoozing. There's a difference. Oh, not the stupid dancing gorilla again. I know you love the dancing gorilla, Vori. Don't try to deny it. And aren't you supposed to be prepping for the Sandy Gulch expedition right now? Don't worry, governor. We're not all as uptight as Vori here. Some of us have a sense of humor and can talk about things other than protocol and mission objectives from time to time. Jack, this call is over. Please don't make me add insubordination to the report I'm filing for the commissioner. Thanks for proving my point, Bori. 
Jack Torren, signing off. Okay, I really like Jack. <laughs> you know, I kind of do. He's a little more fun. Let's see We'd what this like mission is. The colony's population. 200, we can do 200. That won't be problem. Okay. Okay. Zorium's up. Again, these guys don't really do a whole lot, but that is good policing range. <clears throat> well, that just helps. Okay. As I said about air quality, this thing will suck your air quality down. So, we need to go ahead and get yet another one of these. Which means, yet again, another one of these. Actually, no, we don't, because we have this. So that's producing quite a lot of energy. But that's actually nowhere near enough, so I do need another one of these. Okay. That will give us more health care. I will need to build yet another hospital down here. Same power, just things. Let's put it right here. And I'll have to build more storage here in a little bit. What's our storage mainly full of? Glow. Melons. Pasta. Water, I kind of wish we had more of, but that's okay. The candy, I just wish they would get that out. Are we trading stuff? Um, we'll do that. <clears throat> really, the big thing right now is just getting enough nanos. Which, because we're having that issue, let's upgrade these. And I know one of the problem is right now is that I'm just overextended. That I don't actually have enough people working places to make it feasible to keep doing this. But I'm just going to keep throwing them on. Okay, so people are actually pretty happy, and that's a good thing. We have quite a lot of structures. As you can see, we can only have 300. That's why you go through and you demo the less efficient buildings. So, these things... Well, not that, but this, 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 and this. Oh, we're still producing plenty of glow. I wish we could get a radius for this. <clears throat> Kim plants producing nanomeds, which we are using mainly to treat the issues with the other food. Plague vaccines, probably once we get to a thousand of those, I will just end it. Let's go ahead so we get more power. Yeah, the batteries will turn on, hold us for a little bit while we get this upgraded. Do we got, do we have things there that we can make consumer goods? I don't know. But you know what, you're getting hollow units. What we do with you? Bread and pasta are very high up. People love them. People absolutely love them. <clears throat> Thank you. 
that up. Big thing right now is just trying to get these nanites. Oh, do -do 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 -do. Okay, one thing, when you are using uh, farms, like, the, really the only good time to do is when stuff is scattered out, and I don't really ever have that issue. Or at least I didn't used to. Okay, we almost have the barley, then we can get more consumer goods. Have a bunch of that. <clears throat> yeah, let's see about getting that thing. Okay, we're right here. Mainly for the gold, the bread. Maybe a little building area, but that's really just not even all that useful when we have over here. Lightning kit, powers up. And, and that's another way you can play. Like, for me, I tend to want to have enough energy to have a positive throughout the winter. You can just build a bunch of battery banks and coast it. That's not a bad plan. Alright, I'm gonna take it off that. Uh, whenever we do get that type of stuff up. Porridge we can make just with barley, pasta with just flour, bread. As you can see, Amber Jewelry, Bliss, Gold Bloom, a lot of this, let's get to work on that. A lot of this I don't really care for. I need your help to balance our supplies on the... Really? Four hundred and fifty. Let's pick that up, and that will get us a bit closer. <clears throat> and I think I'm going to build the Earth's center right here. It's a pretty big building. Normally I go for the space elevator, because that's fast exchange of people and goods. Oh, I've been looking at the stadium. Yeah, we need this. <laughs> Long time to build, it's annoying. Uh, trade goods, what else can we do? We have the melon, so we will do that. Because that won't take long. I'm out of things to talk about right now about this game. I truly, truly do not know what to talk about. We're still trying to get people in. Uh, storage. Alright, I'm just gonna go ahead and throw that in so not to worry about it. Really, it's just getting nanos up. Probably could afford to get another center up. Once we get this, I will then put that stuff up and be done. Okay, that should be taken out. It takes about two shots of these. And 
Yep, see, two. Now, later on, just like these lightning towers, you kind of want to have a bunch of guns up. Mainly when you get to colder maps because of the hail. That will tear you up. Let's go ahead and try to max this out. <clears throat> Pardon me. This thing loading cargo going up yet? Yeah, we still need that 200, and the problem is, is that we have to follow these to eventually get to the end game, which this has gone on much longer than I thought. So, <laughs> a long thing. No one's joined the chat, Sally. I don't even know if I'm actually showing anywhere, but that's just how it is. That is just how it is. Got plenty of Zorium. This should soon... Yeah, we're digging through our copper reserves, so soon I'll just put this back to normal. And we'll go right about here to normal. Alright, this will eat up stuff, but since we will need to have this anyways, I'm going to go ahead and put you right here. And let's get a crystal. Speaking about ice shards and needing to have defenses, I did not think that this one would do that so early. Yeah, we'll have to launch repairs. That that makes me very unhappy. There we go. <clears throat> and we're good. Shard storms, hail, pretty much. This will take a while to build up, so. If I say this is low, let's try to get that, because you cannot tell them to upgrade a building. There we go. We'll get that up. That will allow some more people in. There we go. Now I'm going to put this as a medium. Okay, since that is the case now, I'm going to put that as a very low priority job. Tell them to get up into these areas and get to work. And since things are pretty much going well, let's just go ahead and do this trade. Yes, we can do that. We have the barley. I think we have the barley. Yes, we have the barley. <laughs> so that'll be good. I don't know what to talk about. I guess um, as we reach the end of this, and I've really wish these people would hurry up. Immigration Center, I'm going to boost you up so we get some faster people. This is almost done. Uh, research complete, that's good. Plasma, boost, tarry bread, oatmeal, whatever. I'll just tell them to produce everything. Got plenty of that. Iron's alright. There's our earth center. 
Whoa, that uses a lot more people than I thought it would, but it will. <laughs> people are able to commute still. I might build one over here, just to make it easier for people to commute a bit more. Oh, uh, nah, uh, never mind. Never mind. There we go. <clears throat> so right now we just need more people. So, tell them to max that out so we can get plenty of people. I could add in another hub, but I'm not going to. We'll go ahead and get that upgraded. Get a few things in. Food's still good. And food is not good. So let's come here. Rice is tasty. Let's get some more wheat. Go right hey, there. That wheat. I got a special objective. In the middle of summer? Really? Uh, just to make myself feel a little bit better. Really? Ugh, that makes me angry. So I'm gonna build one there. One there. Repair this. Repair this. That's what? What are you? Antari, I don't like Antari. Let's go back to melons. Try to get people plenty of food. Wheat still probably kind of like the best. No, we still in range. New. No. I'm gonna go ahead and build one right here. Our food has really dropped. I'm just shocked so much that our food's dropped. Everything. <clears throat> so we'll try to get more food up running. Yeah, it won't be that bad. Producing plenty of flour, I'll go ahead and upgrade this, that will allow us to produce just a bit faster, that gives us plenty of pasta. Uh, since we're not trading that anymore, we can go ahead and get that. Porridge, pasta, just try to give them a little bit higher quality food. <coughs> It's surrey, just plenty of food. Bliss it's time done. For a referendum election. Okay, don't care, don't care, don't care, don't care. How even is our crime stuff? Like over here is kind of like the problem. Get here. Let's turn that off and just. Upgrade. Get a few more drones out. <clears throat> Go to... Okay, that's still good. How have we not gotten enough pop yet? Can't remember where my retail is. Does it still have stuff? I think you're on track to win this referendum. Too crowded. Okay, someone's I've complaining about smell. Probably right in this area. So let's go ahead and get one right there. And just to make sure everything's fine. Quality's good. I can't 
cannot believe it doesn't tell me how good food is here. It just driving me nuts. We have a new trade mission available. Clues, I don't want to trade with you right now. I want to get this population because this has been an almost two hour stream and I want to be done. And the reason why I'm saying I wouldn't be done is because I want to get something more to your drink. And happy with your performance, and I think well, you no one's joined the stream, so referendum. my heart is broken. <laughs> Not really. I sold that thing off about mm, two years ago, three years ago, four years ago. I don't know. Let's get this stuff repaired. <clears throat> There we go, just need one more person. And since that's the case, let's just go back to normal. Alright, hopefully... Do we really not have any defenses to break? Oh. Wow. Alright, I'm actually tired of manually doing that, so here we go. <clears throat> We'd like you to expand your colony's population. That was annoying. Well done, Governor. The Vanar colony is now stable and should serve as a solid foothold for our expansion. We'll be placing a junior governor from our training program in charge of this colony as you move on to greater things. Your next mission will take you to a desert area known as Sandy Gulch, where we'll need you to construct a new mining colony. Okay, well, we reached victory, because we built this already, and it was already there for a year once you got past the 200. So, this mission's over. I'll see you guys in the next mission. Yeah. So, I'll see you all in the next one. Goodbye.